What's up everyone? I am so excited because we are officially in... That was very anticlimactic. You cannot see anything. <laughs> we are officially in Hawaii. I'll show you our view in a second. But we got here yesterday. It was definitely a long travel day, especially because we had handsome. We had we ended up getting our bags to nine checked bags and two carry-ons and two backpacks. So 13 bags in total. So it was a little crazy just traveling with all that stuff but everything worked out handsome passed his inspection so if you aren't familiar we had to go through a very like long process to get handsome to the island because it's a rabies free state so they take it very seriously but he passed with flying colors and he was able to come in perfectly fine with no quarantine he just got direct release at the airport so a vet actually met us there and um, checked him out and approved him so that was like a breeze so that was very nice everything went very smoothly and then after we landed we went and picked up our car that got shipped there um, and then Kyle took an Uber to get the car and then came back to the airport and picked me up we vlogged our travels on the Cayenne and Kyle channel so if you want to see more of that go ahead and watch that video but this video I don't know I'm gonna just take you along on our first couple days here we have a very exciting couple of days so I first want to tell you guys like how we even got the place we're staying in and like just how much God has provided for this move let me show you around we're staying at a timeshare right now my grandparents were actually able to get us this and this place is huge um, it's definitely a mess so bear with me but I'll show you all right this is the front door and then there's two rooms you got the living room over there this is the bedroom the bathroom I don't mind the mess but it's such a big room hi Hansi are you taking a nappy And then look at this view. Hey babe. Yeah. Just saying hi. Oh, uh, what's up? Look at this view. I'm not mad about it. Yeah. yeah. Another bathroom. Sorry if it's loud. There's like the dishwashers going, we have a full on kitchen. We just went grocery shopping. And we have living room and another balcony Whoa. Oh, oh, no. Oh, no. oh no oh no oh no oh no the puppy oh that's a puppy oh my gosh oh my gosh <laughs> no he's got my hair oh, get over here yeah. get out of her face <laughs> there's a puppy at that Oh, oh wow. Okay boys, we gotta be quiet because I'm gonna film. Okay. Okay, okay, we have to be quiet. <laughs> yeah, you guys are so quiet. at all you guys go to the other room all right, all right, all right, all right let's go. get your own room but i wanted to tell you guys how we got this place because originally we were supposed to move here with another couple and their family and unfortunately they couldn't come anymore which is so sad we wish they were here um but we had booked an airbnb with them to share and it was quite expensive i think we would have ended up paying like $1,800 to stay there for the 10 days um, so when they couldn't go we didn't want to pay for the whole thing by ourselves um, and at that point it was like a month before the trip so we didn't have many options left and my dad suggested that I call my grandma because they have timeshares here so I called her and she was able to get us this place 
for nine nights for only a hundred and seventy five dollars which is it's insane like normally one night at a place would be a hundred seventy five dollars so the fact that we were able to save so much money and we found a place like right away without any trouble was just such a blessing so we're very very grateful for that and then on top of that we actually found a place to live so we were planning to come out here and basically search for an, a place to live for our nine days um, because it is quite difficult to find a place if you're not here but literally God just worked everything out just so perfectly and I think it gave us just more confidence and confirmation that like this is his will and he is making a way when it seems impossible and hopeless like the Finding a place was what was most nerve-wracking. Just have like a rat's nest. <laughs> so the fact that we found a place is just so cool. So it's actually under renovation still. It should be ready in about, I don't know, by the time we're done staying here. So we're hoping like a week and a half it should be ready. And Kyle is actually going to be helping out with some of the renovations. We were originally gonna go over there tomorrow but um, the, our landlord called and said he could use some help today. So we're gonna go see it today. I'm so excited. I'll give you guys Hansy, Wancy. So that's really exciting. And then while they work on things, oh, another, I need to tell you the full story of how we found a, how we found this place, but I think we might do that on our couple channel. So I'll let you guys know when we have that uploaded so you guys can um, hear the whole story because it's such a God story. It's, it's just amazing. And they also have a dog. Do you hear that? They have a dog. So Handsome's going to have a best friend next door because they live on the property. Um, it's an Ohana, which is basically like a small house on their property. So we're like next door to neighbors and we have our own little space which is so nice because there's a yard um, and his grandma lives right next door and she has a fenced in yard so like the dogs can play whenever they want and they get to meet today so I'm I'm praying that they just become besties because you need a friend I think their dogs like an Aussie mix and they have a lot of energy so I think he should be able to keep up with handsome's handsome's energy right buddy while they work i might head to target so i want to start getting some of our home stuff i've been able to order a few things we have our couch ordered our bedding ordered our bed frame order our our mattress ordered so everything should be arriving before we move in except for the couch i think the couch might take a little bit longer um, but I need to get like the essentials. I need like plates and silverware and just all the things. I've been trying to make a list. All right, here's the outfit of the day. The top is Brandy Melville. Shorts are Gonda. They're like, they're like a knit short. And then I'm wearing the Alex tote from Holly Sunday. It's also available in this like really pretty periwinkle blue color. So we just restocked them. So definitely pick one up. And I'm just like packing my swimsuit because I think we'll go to the beach later. And yeah. Pulling up to our spot for the first time. Hey, hey, hey. Big 
closet. Closets are pretty small. Storage in general is limited, so we're gonna have to get creative. This is the bathroom. We're gonna get like a nice big waterfall shower head. They bought a new vanity and a new toilet and a new mirror. Um, and it's gonna be kind of similar to the cabinet color in our old place, so like a wood. Then this is the smaller bedroom. We're gonna use this as the office and guest room. I think I'm gonna do like a Murphy bed here and it'll like fold out when we have guests. And then maybe like my desk along this wall. And this one also has a small closet. And then we have a little backyard area. This area down here, we can use as our backyard. And then there's like a little back porch and then our washer and dryer will be outside. So we haven't seen the cabinets up, so I have no idea really what the kitchen is gonna be like. Like, I don't know. Maybe this is the oven. And maybe the fridge is over here. But so nice. I'm not sure. I guess um, we'll probably do the couch here. And then we'll have to use that wall as uh, for the TV. And then this is nice because if you look closely, you can see it's actually, there's some like paneling. So excited. Can you guys see all the potential? Because I can. Okay, we just, well, I just left the house. We got to see the flooring they're putting in. I also got to see the vanity that they're swapping it out, which is really nice because that the sink in the bathroom, as you saw, has like, well, the bathroom in general has zero storage. So they're going to have a vanity put in that has um, a big cabinet underneath. So that's awesome. Uh, I'm so excited and then the dogs got along amazingly like instant best friends so that is amazing we got to meet the owners and um, his mom is like the sweetest thing ever and they're so nice and the God story on how they even got the house is so cool too so it's just awesome everything God's doing and all the ways he has just his hand is all over everything. So it's really, really cool to see and such a blessing. And the place has so much potential. I'm so excited to move in and to start decorating everything. I already have some things planned. I've been using an app called Spoke. Um, it, you can get on it on your browser and you can design rooms virtually. And it's been really fun to kind of imagine our space can also like make floor plans so you can kind of see what size bed might fit what size couch would fit things like that so that's really helpful um so far i've only kind of planned out our bedroom so i'll insert a picture of kind of like what i came up with the inspiration for our bedroom but anyway now i'm at target so just gonna buy some i don't know We'll see. I might go crazy. <laughs> this might be my biggest target haul yet. Last night we were there till I think like nine ish. Nine, yeah. But what's up, y'all? Didn't get much accomplished. <laughs> oh man, no, we did not. <laughs> it but. should have been. I don't know. Well, you got caught up. We were we met um, their mom, like who lives on the property too, and <laughs> she's the sweetest like, lady. Ever. So nice. So he was talking to her for like an hour. So they didn't get started till later. Um, but yeah, they were having issues with the flooring. So yeah, it just seemed like everything. <laughs> 
that was supposed to work that should have worked just wasn't working yeah. and then we had to like backtrack because it was like messing up work that's already been done and like the vinyl floor is just shifting and gaps were forming and so it was something that really I don't know why it's not working out the way that it's like made to work yeah there's but something obviously wrong so they're today gonna, I'm gonna look into it more yeah today. have some fun and finagle it and see so, what's up um, last night I also rolled my ankle, so I'm kind of limping a bit. However, I did have a productive Target run. <laughs> so we will do a little Target haul once we get there. I'll show you, everything's just in the trunk right now. So do a little Target run. So we're heading back to the house today. It's about a 45 minute like hour drive. So it's quite a long drive to get there because um, we got a resort on the other side of the island, but that's okay. So today, Kyle's gonna power wash the house because it's getting painted tomorrow, which is really exciting. It's gonna be like a cactus green color, which I think will be super cute, way better than the red color that it is now. Yeah. Um, I feel like the cactus green will just make it very more islandy and happy. Um, and I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm probably going to be at the house for a little bit and get some like measurements of things. Um, and then I might just hang at the beach, just relax and try to stay off my ankle as much as possible. I'm like kind of hoping after the power washing that the floor still doesn't work so I can go to the beach with you. Because uh, yeah. if I can start getting it going, I'm going to... I'm yeah. gonna stay behind and finish that. Yeah. But it'd be so sad to go to the beach without me. <laughs> Kyle is almost done with the power washing. I think we're gonna go to the beach for a little bit and then we'll probably come back when um, they get back so he can work on the floor some more tonight. But I wanted to go give you guys the little Target haul of what I bought yesterday. Okay, I got two of these bath sheets. These ones in particular were very, very soft. So I recommend them. I also got one of these waffle towels. Also got these measuring cups. Very simple. I love this little leather strap that holds them together and the matching measuring spoons. And these are from this brand. I got two of these small bowls. These are always just nice to have for like dips. This nude colored washcloth with a hook on it. I ended up getting the waffle knit shower curtain. I don't like love the way it looks here, but if you look at the picture, the texture is a lot nicer when it's actually um, let out. And then I got these dinner bowls. I got two of these. I was unsure about this color, but I think it's growing on me. And then I also got um, the matching dinner plates. The next thing I got was this shower organizer. And then I picked up this really modern diffuser. And then I found this really big circular wooden mirror. Um, that's kind of what it looks like. Only $60, which I thought was a really good price. And then <laughs> hiding under here. It's going to be hard to pull out. Let me see. Okay, the last thing I got was this curtain rod for our bedroom windows. I love how just sleek it is and that we can kind of round out the curtains. Are you helping with my haul? Um, and this one is the bigger one because our windows are 72 inches. So <sighs> I think this one will be above our bed. And then I might just get some more simple black ones because this one was a little bit more expensive. But I think I'll just get some more simple black ones for all the other windows. Or maybe some wood ones. I don't know. 
I'm like, I've never really had black accents before. We got that's black and this is black. Diffuser's black, so we'll see. It has been a few days. We're back at the house. Here's a little sneak peek of the new color. It looks so cute. Handsome's up there on the porch. I don't know if you can see him, but we have a lot of exciting projects we're going to work on today, but I'm going to finish the vlog here and start a new one. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you are excited for this new home content coming your way. Love you guys. People are here. I get a little awkward. Gotta go. Jesus loves you more.